With fewer companies investing in brick and mortar and focusing on their online presence instead, Perch, a high-end kitchen bath and outdoor product retailer, stands out for its contrarian approach to reaching consumers. And it's currently number 25 on the Forbes list of America's most promising companies. Here to tell us more is Perch CEO Jeffrey Sears. Jeffrey, thanks so much for being with us. It's a pleasure. So tell us what inspired you to start Perch. It, was, it came out of a personal experience, is that right? Well, it's a combination of personal experiences between um, the partners, but it was really this um, opportunity to go to buy a kitchen bath product and being actually offended by the process, things that are supposed to inspire you in your home. Angered you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and so now you have showrooms where people can have hands-on experiences. Tell us what kinds of experiences shoppers can have. Well, they're expansive. There are 20 to 32,000 feet. Uh, we have completely interactive kitchens, spas, everything works. You can try before you buy and it's really about um, asking the guests to be inspired but um, empowered at the same time and then when they leave assured that they've seen what's possible. So how interactive is it? Can I bring my dirty clothes and do my laundry and try out a machine? You could bring your 600 cotton count sheets and... Uh, I love it. Uh, you could. Can I bring a bathing suit and try out a shower head? You could do that or not. Right. Meaning the, ba the bathing suit. Right, know. right, exactly, <laughs> depending on how it goes. So what, what has the response been? I mean, do consumers say, this has made all the difference, I thought I wanted that product, but now that I actually see how they work, I realize I want this product? I think it's impacted the professional community, design, architecture, builder, and the consumer, because the consumer now can see what's possible, and then they can dream, and then instruct what they're needs are and then that allows really the inspiration to come from the professional community so and how many showrooms do you have now we have eight and then nine will be at uh, Soho uh, at Broom in Lafayette and they're all enormous <laughs> uh, they're large so, but they're large for a reason because right. there's a lot to do so how do you curate with so many kitchen and bath products out there I mean the, it's endless how do you choose the products that you highlight in your stores we have a team, uh, which also includes uh, departments, so our chefs, our installation groups, uh, our salespeople, um, and we, we vet them very, very personally because we don't want products in our stores that we don't believe in. Right. And that allows the consumer to come in and feel confident and just dream and not worry about whether the product's uh, viable or not. Right. Okay, so obviously brick and mortar is where it's at, but what is your philosophy regarding an online presence? I'm sure you're not ignoring that altogether. Not at all. Uh, we built the uh, brick and mortar foundation to learn. Mm -hmm. And uh, what I don't believe in is a digital strategy. I just think digital is part of your overall vision and strategy. So we'll be launching that in uh, April of next year. All right, Jeffrey Sears, Perch CEO, thank you so much for coming to talk to us today. It's a pleasure. Thank you so much.